again, this is Chris with WatchMojo.com. Now having a dead car battery can run you the risk of being stranded. And though the kindness of strangers is really helpful, it doesn't really do anything without a set of these, jumper cables. Determine the exact cause your car won't start. If the engine cranks when you turn the key, the problem is not the battery. Similarly, if the accessories work, windshield wipers, lights, and heat blower, the battery is probably fine, and the starter may be down. A jump start will not solve anything. Otherwise, break out jumper cables and hail another motorist. Open both car hoods. Make sure that the battery voltages match. In most cases, they do. The cars should not be touching. Turn off the booster car. Attach the red cable's end to the positive terminal on the dead battery. Wipe it clean with a rag to identify it, or Remember that the positive terminal is slightly larger than the negative side. Attach the other end of the red cable to the booster battery's positive terminal. Put the black jumper cable's end to the booster battery's negative terminal and attach the other end of the cable to the ground on the dead car's engine. Any solid metal part works fine. Look for unpainted areas. Stand back from the hood areas and do not light a cigarette. You may see a normal spark go off at the last connection. Turn on the booster car, rev the engine. Five minutes later, start your car. If it doesn't start, jiggle each cable's end and try again. Let it purr, you're good to go. Never jumpstart a frozen battery. If the solution inside the battery is frozen, it could cause an explosion. 